Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming uh, and in today's video I'm going to do another Forzathon guide uh, this time it's for the Crash and Splash Forzathon uh, which is all about extreme off-road cars so without further ado let's get stuck straight in um, so obviously this week's challenge you can use any extreme off-road car you want now chances are you'll have quite a few but the one I went for was the 2012 Bowler EXRS. I have made two tunes as well. One of them is called Fastest S1, which is what I'll be using in this video. Uh, and there's another one just called Fastest Tune, which is basically an incredibly stupidly powerful version of it. Uh, but without further ado, using the S1 tune, let's get stuck into the first challenge, which wants you to win five of the cross country series races. So obviously you can filter them just to show any cross country races of your choice. Um, but I basically stuck with one made it a one lap race kind of thing that's the quarry one just there that i use um so basically it's a rinse and repeat it's very quick and easy like i said i just made it sort of for any sort of extreme off-road cars change the weather to clear just so it's easier uh, and set it to one lap and then all you have to do is complete that five times the reason i did this is it's basically a lot quicker than doing the sort of lengthy sprint races um because it's over within about a minute something like that it's very very quick uh, and like I said, if you want to use the tune that I've created, it's incredibly helpful, um, the S1 tune that is. Otherwise, if you use the S2 one, it's pretty bonkers, but it's fun nevertheless. Um, so like I said, all you have to do is keep on rinsing and repeating five times and you'll complete it. It'll go up by one every single time you complete the race. Obviously, you do have to win. Um, but like I said, it's very, very simple. It doesn't even matter what difficulty you've got it on either. That's the best thing about this one. Uh, so you don't have to have it on expert or anything like that. Very, very quick and easy. Uh, the next challenge here wants you to get a two star score or above on any speed zone. Now, there are lots to pick from, uh, to be honest. It, they're not all that difficult but the one I went for was this forest green as you've only got to get 90 mile an hour to get three star and 75 mile an hour to get two star which is very very easy and again using that S1 tune that I showed at the beginning um, I managed to complete it hitting 115 mile an hour uh, so that's way over the three star limit and all you need is to get two stars uh, so as you can see it's a very very quick and easy one it doesn't require that much skill there's not too many difficult bends in there either uh, for your sort of your speed to go down and even on the end I fluffed it a bit uh, and still managed quite a good final score on the speed zone of three stars very simple very easy to complete that one there um, so like I said not too difficult use the s1 tune and the final one just wants you to get 10 ultimate wreckage skills now there's multiple locations you can use to get these you can just roam across the whole map ragging the crap out of your car uh, and hitting a ton of stuff or you can go to the rail yard or you can do what i did and i went to the little airstrip just over here um, and basically ultimate wreckage skills as i'm sure you're aware is just getting multiple wreckage skills in sort of quick succession and you just keep wrecking stuff uh, and racking up the score again it's another very easy one this one might be a little time consuming um, but there's so much stuff to crash into here at the airfield that it shouldn't actually take you guys too long and again i'm using that s1 tune that i created for this um, description of that is just in the description below basically um, but anyway guys i hope this helped you out uh, and of course this will get you on your way to winning the number 25 RTR Mustang, the drift one, um, of which I will be releasing another video tomorrow of how to win that. Um, but again, it's basically just winning multiple challenges uh, and completing them. But anyway, like I said, I hope that this video has helped you out. Uh, a massive thank you to everyone who's joined the channel. Your support really does mean a lot to me and a huge thank you also to the people who have been here from a long time ago. Um, so like I said, I hope this helped you out. If you've got any questions, please do drop them in the comments below uh, and I will get back to all of them as best as I can. But again, a massive, massive thank you. If you did like this, don't forget to drop a like. And if this continues to help you out, please do subscribe for more. But a massive thank you, like I said, and all the best, guys.